Back here in Texas, hundreds of nurses across the state are planning to strike tomorrow. Ascension Seton nurses say they are understaffed, which forces them to work longer shifts and take on more patients than they are capable of caring for. Our Dylan Scott spoke with some nurses who say better working conditions will lead to better care. She was one of the sweet. I know she was proud of me and I know I know she'd be proud of what I'm doing right now. Monica Gonzalez has been taking care of others her entire life, including her mother during her long battle with multiple sclerosis. Learned how to do a lot of nursing tasks before I learned how to do them in nursing school. A passion became a profession, and for the last 20 years, she's been providing patients with high quality support at Ascension Seton Medical Center Austin. However, the Central Texan claims cost cutting methods by the healthcare provider where they could have up to six patients and training duties during a shift, have hurt her ability to properly care for others. We've got one hand tied behind our back and we're still providing good care. But if they untied the other hand, if we weren't hobbled, how much better that care would be. Gonzalez says it's time. Huelga, which is Spanish for strike. So on Tuesday, hundreds of nurses across Texas and Kansas will make their voices heard demanding for changes such as a professional practice committee and aid in recruitment and retention. It's had to come to this because we have been going to bargaining sessions after bargaining session after bargaining session, and I feel like we're being stonewalled. Spectrum News 1 reached out to Ascension Seton multiple times and received a statement in which the provider expressed disappointment in the National Nurses Union strike saying they've been bargaining in good faith and have only had eight sessions overall to come to terms. Gonzalez and all those striking will be replaced by temporary employees for a four day period. A penalty she says they're easily willing to pay for an improved workplace. Nurses aren't willing to wait idly by while they sit up in their boardrooms. Um, we are serious about wanting changes for ourselves and for our patients. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. For more refreshing stories about your community, click the subscribe button over here. You can also download our Spectrum News app and tune in to Channel 55 on Dish and DirecTV to get live news coverage, weather updates every 10 minutes, and more. We'll see you then.